Now let's talk about the products we spray on our bodies. I found out I was pregnant when I was in an area that was heavy with mosquitoes. And if you are pregnant now, you may have already noticed that the mosquitoes just love you. That is due to the higher blood volume in your body during pregnancy. When researching my choices of repellents, I read on the internet that most doctors and the manufacturer of DEET said it was okay to use while pregnant. I was shocked. DEET is, after all, a poison. Regardless of whether you are spraying it or lathering it on your body, DEET is going to get absorbed into your body. Studies show about 5 to 15% of the mixture gets absorbed into your bloodstream and therefore can likely reach your baby. While many doctors have indicated it is safe for use during pregnancy, there have been incidents of children and pregnant women who are exposed to this product regularly having reactions. Side effects of DEET include dizziness, nausea, memory loss, and seizures. DEET was discovered in 8% of cord blood samples in one study. However, no adverse effects were apparent in those babies. It is still disturbing that this toxin was discovered in the cord blood, and since other natural repellents are available, it is best, in my opinion, to switch to a safer product. It is also important to minimize or eliminate exposure to children since the potential for reactions is higher in babies and children. The safer choices are wearing long sleeves and pants. Citronella has not been researched. However, it is considered a safer choice by some. Lavender oil is another choice. There are also natural products on the market that do not contain DEET that are safer choices. It is best if possible to spray outside and on clothes rather than on skin.